Right, question 180. You're a mad scientist. What scientific experiment would you run if money and ethics weren't an issue? Oh. Okay. Hang on, I missed the question. <laughs> Cloning of glamour, mo glamour models, perhaps. <laughs> All right, what was the question again? You're a mad scientist. What scientific experiment? Oh, yeah, well, easily. <laughs> what scientific experiment would you run if money and ethics weren't an issue? Uh, brain transplants. Uh, with which goal? Just to just get them working perfectly. Yeah. Yeah, that'd be good. He wouldn't have that to way, kill, um, kill off many thousands of people, I reckon. To get it well, working. that way, if you... <laughs> yeah, but I mean, if you've got someone who's brain dead, but the body's all right, you can transfer somebody else's brain into that who's the other way around, and... You know? <sighs> Tom oh. said, genetically engineer a race of cat girls. Oh, He's a furry. <laughs> Oh. Um, I think Sammy was trying to get in, Dave, as well. No. Nope. The nope. reason he posted in the, the Twitter was to demonstrate why he wouldn't. Ah, okay. I misunderstood. <laughs> Sal. Uh, I, I was going to go with something genetic, but I am leaning more towards something technical. Um, like... Something I, I would invest like all, my, <laughs> all I could into recording dreams. But there's nothing unethical Ooh. about that. Oh, you want it to be unethical? Oh, well, it's okay. if, if if ethics and money weren't a concern. Oh, okay. Right. Recording right. people's nightmares then, so you can play it back to them. <laughs> <laughs> but, um, no, then then yeah, I would definitely see and test um the um extent of of. of how much humans can endure pain. <laughs> Ooh. See, that's evil. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we, with with any particular aim, or you just want to inflict the pain? <laughs> I would just want to see the reaction, not even like inflict it. I just want to see what happens. Like, okay, if we do this, what happens? Okay. Hmm. Can flat earthers fly? Let's find out. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good one. We, we, what we happens if you know one of them tried to use a, a water-powered rocket? Remember? Yeah, oh, that's true. Yeah. Oh, bad taste. Bad, bad, bad example. Bad example. Oh, we've lost Bill. Yeah, he'll be right back. Yeah. I was surprised to learn that Aaron talked to him and knew him. Hmm. Oh. oh yeah, yeah. He yeah he spoke to him. Mm -hmm. By all accounts, he was quite a nice guy. Oh, yeah. Um, th Tom, I'd, I'd have to point out here that um, wouldn't you rather, if you want a fierce and loyal um, pet as a, as a human anthrop anthropomorphic pet, wouldn't you want a dog girl, not a cat girl? Because there is nothing loyal about cats. <laughs> <laughs> My cat was loyal, sorry. Wait a minute, oh, is I... there something loyal about cats when they're in packs? Yeah. Yeah. Especially the big cats. Yes. <laughs> right. No, my cat was very loyal to me. Extremely loyal. It all depends on how you raise them. Say again? It all depends on how you raise them. That really has a lot to do with it. Do you know the question, Bill? He's gone again. Um, mad experiment. No, I'm here. The, yeah. uh, the mad experiment thing. Yes. Mm hmm um yeah. i i think i'd probably go for some kind of uh some kind of mk ultra mind control thing to be honest mm -hmm. because if you can control people's minds you can control everything and anything yeah we could really fuck some shit up <laughs> <laughs> we need money people <laughs> yeah, like you could literally do anything you want do you know what i mean yeah. yes if you can actually control people's minds the world is your oyster you own everything do you know what i mean you just, that would be it I mean, put, what, what worries me Okay, we already have the psychology to min to 
intentionally manipulate on a mass scale. Oh yeah. And I'm fairly oh, yeah. certain that that it's one of those things that's not talked about outside much outside of academia, but I'm fairly certain governments are, are uh, heavily researching it. Yeah. Well, so MK Ultra was a real thing mm. up until the 70s. It was an actual real thing that the US right. government admitted to doing, like yeah. But it was focused on an individual. It was right. individuals yeah, rather than yeah. mass. Um, right. The problem is, is, thing is, if you can control one mind, you can control them all. If you understand, yeah, but you the can't. Of that's the point. It, it's it's a math. It's it's a statistical thing. You can't control every mind. You, you need like, to be able to um, abandon some. It was like the speed they gave the, the soldiers of, in the World War. Um, each army, <laughs> each country was trying their own stuff, and and. They realize that we could we can't do this because it's on. It makes a soldier ineffective. Like you yeah. keep them up for yeah. long. Yeah. Right. Wait there. Two two things. Julie said an experiment with downloading information directly into the brains, like languages. Yeah, that's. A I great don't see answer. the negative of that. <laughs> no, but no, I could I see. I'd reckon you could progress the research a lot quicker if you were unethical about it. Oh, Very I agree with so. you there. Yeah. <laughs> um, and and that nerdy. Like, that's. Um, that's the thing with the Sorry. question. No. Go on. Well, Nerdy said the problem with dog girls is they keep trying to sniff your butt. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> That's very true. Uh, right. They also try to sniff your crotch. <laughs> <laughs> would they be classed as a different species? Yeah. <laughs> Also, would it be bestiality? Well, that was my act. That, I was implying that question. <laughs> also, if you guys can have your dog girls, do we get dog boys as well? Well, is anything. Well, the, point, that I'm... the point would be is that it would be a dog brain in a human body, effectively. Yeah, it so, would yes. be bestiality, wouldn't it? <laughs> and it'd be basically a sex slave, and that's kind of creepy. <laughs> Oh, well, you see, no one's ever seen a dog turn into something that's not a non-dog. You know, <laughs> I wonder where that would fit. <laughs> yeah, right. I would, yeah, invest money in turning back time. Mm. Mm. We know how to do that. Fly yeah. around the planet, spin it in another direction until then. Then <laughs> okay. Superman is taught us anything. You watch yeah. too many Superman movies. <laughs> <laughs> but you'd have the money to try it. Okay. You yes. could technically like 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 have a rocket do it, right? Like you could build something that would fastly spin the earth. No, backwards. no, you, I'm fairly certain that the 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 the, 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 the amount of energy it would take <laughs> to rotate the planet's orbit. <laughs> To change the planet's how, how about rotation. developing a virus that only attacks people with an IQ be, below a certain level? No, that's that kills. People. It would mutate. Yeah, yeah, that's true. Probably, yeah. Every generation, right? And it, don't forget, it can go through thousands of generations. Every generation, it would work out, then it would increase the IQ point by one. So by the end of next yeah. week, everyone would be dead. <laughs> <laughs> But it would try and resurrect Einstein. Right. <laughs> that would probably also inevitably include people that you really wouldn't want it to include as well. <laughs> you know I mean? Oh, of course yeah. that would. But we're talking about being unethical here. <laughs> <laughs> okay. That's true. That's well, true. The thing is, it's not necessarily the goal. That. It's not necessarily that the goal has to be unethical. It's, you know, the goal itself could be ethical. It's the, the method, the methods mm. as well. The methods. It? The, well, the goal, the goal could be to increase the uh, average intelligence of the population and weeding out those that are less intelligent would actually help evolution to breed more intelligent humans. If could evolution might, or... still might not breed more in, uh, ever, natural yeah, selection for more intelligence. Uh, uh, intelligence is not necessarily a good thing. <laughs> True. <laughs> but again, we're talking... <laughs> Intelligent people don't seem to get on. <laughs> That's always true. 